Okay, number 13 MTOP reviewer with complete solution and explanation. It involves fractions, money problems, um, sum and difference of two numbers, the MDOS rule, and sum of digits. Okay, pang number 13 na po ito. Para ma-update po kayo sa mga videos ko, MTOP reviewer, please don't forget to click the, uh, the like, subscribe, and the bell button below. Thank you. Okay, so let's have problem number one. Alice had 170 pesos and his sister had 60 pesos. After their uncle gave each of them an equal amount of money, they had a total of 310 pesos. How much did their uncle give each of them? Okay, kung binigyan sila ng uncle nila ng equal amount of money, tig magkana silang dalawa. So, unang na natin gagawin is i-plus yung Pera ni Alice at saka sister niya. So, 170 plus 60 equals 230 pesos. And then, um, yung kabuan ng pera nila is 310 pesos. Ima-minus natin yung total na hawak nila dati, which is 230. 310 minus 230, the answer is 80. So, yan yung binigay ng uncle niya na 80 sa kanilang dalawa. So, kung i-divide natin yan sa dalawang sisters, 80 divided by 2, the answer is 40 pesos. So, ibig sabihin, take 40 pesos silang magkapatid. Okay, problem number 2. The sum of two numbers is 27. If their difference is 13, what is the smaller number? So, mag-a-assign tayo ng variable doon sa dalawang numbers. X for the first number, Y for the second number. So, kung kunin natin yung sum nila, x plus y equals 27. If yung difference naman, that is x minus y equals 13. So, ang tanong dito, ano yung number ng smaller number? Okay. So, ang gagawin natin is um, the elimination method. Ia-add natin yung dalawang system or dalawang equation x plus y equals 27 plus x minus y equals 13. Um, x plus x equals 2x. Then, y minus y or y plus negative y is 0. So, ma-eliminate na yung, i-eliminate na yung y o matatanggal na yung y. This equal to 27 plus 13 is 40. So, meron tayong new equation, 2x equals 40. Para matanggal yung 2, um, at ma-solve yung x, i-divide natin siya both side by 2. So, cancel and x is equal to 40 divided by 2 is 20. So, ibig sabihin, um, the first number is 20 and the second number is... To find the second number, and uh, we're going to use the first equation, x plus y equals 27. And then, sa-substitute natin yung value ng x na nakuha natin, which is 20. So, x magiging 20 plus y equals 27. Okay, pwede natin gamitin ng addition property of equality. Pero dito sa example ko, transpose ko lang. Yung 20 nilipat ko sa kabila, positive magiging negative. So, 27 minus 20 is 7. Yun yung second number, y equals 7. So, ibig sabihin, again, yung first number is 20. Yung second number is 7. So, ang tanong dun kanina, what is the smaller number? So, ibig sabihin, um, the right answer is 7, which is the smaller number. Okay, number 3 problem. How many will you have if mother gives 75 pesos and father gives you 3 times as much? So, ito yung solution natin. Si mother nagbigay ng um 75 pesos si father nagbigay siya ng 3 times ng kay mother which is 75 so ita times lang natin yun 3 times 75 is 225 so ang tanong how many will you have or i magkano yung money niya lahat so 75 plus 225 na binigay ni father niya the answer is 300 pesos Okay, next, problem number four. What is the sum of the digits of the product of 25 and 4? So, ang tinatanong, sum ng digit ng product ng 25 at 4. 
So, una step na gagawin natin, we have to find the product ng 25 and 4. So, 25 times 4 is 100. And then, yung the, uh, we have 3 digits, 1, 0, 0. So, we're talking about the sum of the digits. So, ibig sabihin, here add natin yun. 1 plus 0 plus 0 equals 1. So, therefore, the answer is 1. Okay, number 5. How many tenths are there in 3 fifths? So, gagawin lang po natin dyan is to multiply 10 times 3 over 5. So, 10 times 3 is 30 over 5. So, 30 divided by 5, the answer is 6. Okay, thank you so much. Para po sa ma, uh, mas marami po pang intap pro viewer, please don't forget to click the like, subscribe, and the bell button. Thank you.